Let's go. Shit is getting crazy out here. For no fame. Travis Scott. Wickedness. Some wicked shit going on out here. A lot of you just won't stay the fuck in the house. You won't stay in the crib. You won't just chill the fuck out like you niggas got a fucking habit to praise these fucking entertainers and party, party, party. But y'all gonna learn. You gonna learn, Trey. You gonna learn today. And let's get into this shit. Travis Scott. The nigga had a concert yesterday. And they say that eight people lost their life. And 300 injured. But a wise man once told me, whatever numbers, whenever they tell you the numbers on the news, you basically got to triple them numbers. But common sense to tell you, it's more than eight people that's dead. Allegedly. I'm going to break down some shit real quick. Some people say this was a sacrifice. We also got to understand I told y'all it was the harvest season. And I also told you that all these entertainers have to do something at this present day and time to show their allegiance. I told y'all that. Now, we know Travis Scott has the Astro World Tour going on. And one thing I want y'all to understand when you see his album cover, that's one picture. But when you see the theme that he had for this party, see a lot of people that were spiritual, they would have already knew what time it was. Because y'all all walked into your own doom. When you see that skull, that's not the same skull of Travis Scott that's on his record cover. See, the one of his album is gold. But the one y'all walked into, that was the Grim Reaper. Or I say the face of a skeleton, which means death. Then you also going to see he has certain props on the stage. And if you look close enough, you'll see it was a dragon head, a serpent head. Some might say it was the head of Satan. Either way, whoever went to that concert witnessed death and destruction, chaos and mayhem. Because you love to be entertained. But yesterday, the people that went to this concert became entertainment for the world. Because there's some people that love to see shit like this. And they love to see destruction. That's why you got to understand this was a concert from hell. And it represents hell on earth. Because a lot of you love to party, party, party. But you'll understand in the last days, some will be burnt by fire. And maybe Travis Scott knew shit like this, or maybe he didn't. But I got reports that it also was, I heard it from a witness that was there, that was in the party, or at the concert, whatever you want to call it. He spoke on how it was a 14-year-old boy in the crowd. They also speak about how, they were speaking about how it's people... Dying, people screaming, and they said this man was still performing, keeping the show going. And he did not give a fuck what was going on. They said people was getting burnt black and blue, passing out, all type of shit. And then on top of that, everybody got trampled that fell. But you gotta understand, they say earlier that day it was a it was a it was another chaotic event before Master P performed. That's what I'm trying to tell y'all, man. That's the face of death you're looking at. Some know him as Baron Somni. Some might say the Grim Reaper. But just know that's the face of death. And a lot of these people walked into their own destruction. Just like the black race and all other races that deal with stupidity and ignorance because they are not spiritually inclined. They walk into their own demise. Because they want to party, party, party. One day you're going to learn that you need to stay the fuck in the house because we're still in a pandemic and anything goes. 
Therefore, some of you are always going to be face to the fire, but it's not always going to be at a concert. You're going to burn from your own ignorance and your own arrogance. That even though it's a pandemic, people dying, pe people homeless, people losing their mind. It's still a group of people that wants to party, party, party. And they want to have a good time. And they said that in the last days. Or whenever the, whenever the shit go down. It always goes down after the party. That's why you also see recently in the club in New York. You know, people came outside the club and got shot up. And this happens all the time. You go out to have a good time, but you wind up facing your death. Because in America... We are some of the most arrogant people and all they want to do is party, party, party and get wasted. Well, now at this party, some people mm -hmm. literally got wasted. And that's what you see right here. And this was from earlier that day. So this was the warning sign on what was to come. But like I said, before you get to your destination, you always going to get a sign or you're going to come to a sign first. Then you're going to make a right or a left. And this happened earlier they say before master people form. But anybody that's inclined would have known that that was bad energy right there. But these are the same people that wanted to party and party and party. Now look at this picture right here. You also will see at the bottom, this is from Travis Scott Instagram, which means he posted on his page before he performed that night. So maybe he knew something nobody else knew about allegedly. Or maybe this is just a coincidence how he got this on camera and he posted it on his page. But they say when the chaos and mayhem happened that night, they say Travis Scott, he just kept performing like he didn't give a fuck and he didn't know what was going on. So that's what I'm trying to tell y'all. A human life right now is, just, is exposable. And it's more people dying in a pandemic from dumb shit than that's actually dying from the sickness take it or leave it do what you want to do with it but stay the fuck out them clubs and stop trying to fucking party and stay home and raise your kids and if you ain't got no kids party in your own home because you're gonna fuck around and die out here i'm out